Good morning, friends. Today we are back again with another with another interesting video on how to speak on the TOEFL speaking section. So here we go. Now, listen to two students discussing the article. Did you see that article? Yeah, and it sounds like a great idea. It's really good for the students in that program. Don't they cook in class anyway? Well, yeah, they do. But my cousin was in the program a few years ago, and she said that it's very different to cook for a lot of people in that kind of atmosphere than to cook for classmates. Why is that? Well, in class, you can take your time, but cooking for more people, there's more pressure. I mean, you're in a rush, people are waiting, and it might be easy to make a mistake with all that stress. Then they'll think you're a bad chef, right? Absolutely. So, okay, it's good practice. But what about the extra cost? Well, look at it this way. You've eaten at some of the fancier restaurants in town, right? Yeah, there are some great places to eat around here. Well, these students, they'll be making fantastic meals, and it's going to be cheaper than going out to one of those restaurants. Much cheaper, actually. So, you know, it'll be worth it. The meals will be as good as the ones in those expensive restaurants. The man expresses his opinion about the university's plan. State his opinion and explain the reasons he gives for holding that opinion. Begin to prepare your response after the beep. Begin speaking after the beep. The university plans to transform the university hall into a campus dining hall at the end of the at the end of the week in the in one week at the end of the semester. The man agrees with this idea of the university because the students of the culinary arts who will be contesting in, in this dining hall in front of the people and they will be making dishes. It is it is a lot more difficult for the students to prepare these kind of dishes in front of a people where there where people are waiting for them and there is a rush and there is a lot of pressure in these students as compared to the situation in the classroom where they can take all of their time secondly he thinks that when the students are preparing the food in this in this hall this, this is a lot more cheaper than they going out in other restaurants and also when this is cheap the students will be getting their own opportunity to get their food done well. Therefore, he thinks that university idea is really great. Nice. Nice. You said it very nicely. I actually like your answer. Yeah, four seconds before I could feel that you wanted to end, but you saw four seconds, so you ended it much better. You ended it better? Yeah. But also, if you see that it is only four seconds left, right? Like, you can just, you know, slow down your last sentence rather than starting a new sentence. Because at this moment, actually, you were just on time. And it can happen that you are left with two or three words to speak. Or the thing, the other way it can happen, uh, in order to fit in your sentence, you are speaking too quickly and it can, it can be hard to understand. It can be both. So, because uh, I, I was looking at your time and when you started the new sentence, it was just four seconds. Yes. So when you saw the time, and at that time when it was 6 or 7 seconds, just slow down your last sentence. 
and then you can take it it is just that you have to slow down for 2 seconds and if you have the 2 seconds remaining it's fine it's totally fine 2 seconds early is fine the man supports the university plan of allowing the food department students to cook for one week after each semester and and the man supports the university plan because of the following two reasons firstly he thinks that it is very different to cook for large number of people and this will give the food department students a very good experience to serve the large number of people because it is very different to cook for the class because there is no rush and no stress secondly he thinks that he thinks that it will be better because the food will be cheap but will also be of a very good quality as compared to the other fine dining restaurants so the man here totally supports the university plan because of the following above two reasons so mine was 4 seconds early so that's bad um, following above was in the end um, following above in the end because following is after and you are already ending okay. so the above above reasons, the above yeah. reasons. okay but then you will have like, but then you will have 5 seconds in that response if you remove following <laughs> <laughs> okay yeah so i was 5 seconds early i was then you were saying something Yeah, you can say it like the above stated points. Okay, I'll keep that in mind. Thanks for letting me know, guys. So whenever you are ready. The man supports the university's plan of converting the university dining hall into a campus dining club at the end of the semester for the culinary arts students to utilize uh, and prepare food for the uh, rest of the folks. Um, this is because of the following reasons. Firstly, uh, cooking for class or versus cooking for a lot of people is very different in the sense that uh, there is different time and pressure that is involved in while cooking for people uh, there is chance for mistakes uh, that are very less tolerable in cooking for people secondly um, uh, since these are the students who are going to be cooking at a very good restaurants in the future um, you get to eat a lot more good food and pay a lot more lesser than some of the finest restaurants in the city thus the man agrees with the university's plan for converting the dining hall into the campus dining club okay so after you finished your uh, all the points you had around 12 seconds left yes so that's why he took his last sentence super slow yes so yeah it is a time management thing so you have to be careful for it um, and even after he was so slow you actually I'm, completed it 4 seconds before actually i i missed one of the points that i wanted to say uh, about the great experience that they are going to get and things mm-hmm. like that so that part i missed and that's why this time management issue happened right, right. i had 3 points but i said 2 okay next time let's move to the next question passage about target marketing you will have 45 seconds to read the passage begin reading now Now listen to part of a lecture on this topic in a marketing class. 
nowadays, something you notice more and more is television commercials that are made specifically for certain television programs. So uh, let's say a company wants to sell a telephone, a cell phone. Now, during TV shows that young people watch, you know, shows with pop music or teen serials, they create a commercial that emphasizes how fun the phone is. You know, the phone has bright colors and they show kids having a good time with their friends. And, well, the company wants the kids watching TV at this time to want to buy this phone, this phone that's made especially for them. But the same company will make a different commercial to be shown during, say, a program about business or a business news show. Now, for this group of people, business people, the company will have to show how efficient their phone is, uh, how it can handle all business easily and maybe even save money. And here's the thing. It's basically the same phone. The company has just made two different commercials to appeal to different groups of people. Using the professor's examples, explain the advertising technique of target marketing. Begin to prepare your response after the beep. Begin speaking after the beep. The professor gives uh, an explanation of target marketing, which is uh, which is a kind of marketing where companies target small and specific audiences who have the greatest need or desire to buy a company's product. He gives uh, he gives two, two examples of a different commercial company host to sell their product. For a uh, for young, uh, for young generation and population of of the society, the if the company wants to sell a phone, they telecast their ad on a TV show where pop music and serials are telecasted, and they will show how the bright, how bright the color, how bright and colorful the phone is, and the children are having good time. Secondly, on a business television show, the company will telecast how good their uh, phone is and how efficient it is. In, in 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 using their business therefore the company appeals to two different kinds of groups through their television uh, uh, advertisements number five. nicely said and what i actually liked about uh, your uh, like the time management was that we know that for the last thing where it uh, tells about the business you don't have much to say right if you will keep say if you will like keep around 20 seconds you will have nothing to say after 5 seconds and you will have this whole 15 seconds that you will be just saying something right. so it's always better if you feel that there are because in this there were only two points right, right. there are not three points or there are not four points so it's better how you started with it that you took some time to explain the target market it's totally fine because you are covering the examples also well and you're not spending your last 15 seconds as a waste you're just not wasting your last 15 seconds right and um, and the question also says actually you need to explain what target marketing yeah. is so that's right on it always do like for this question they always say it in this way that using the examples explain this this is how this question is framed right right so they always will say this so if you have less point then give more time to the introduction if you have more time more points then give less time to them, yeah. so that you don't miss anything that's what i like in your response yes that was very good the target marketing is a type of marketing that focuses on a very smaller specific audience they do not target the whole audience in a similar way. 
they do have different ways of marketing to target the different audience for in the specific way of their need and desire for the product by the uh, the professor here gives two exam gives an example of a telephone company that if a telephone company has to sell the, the telephone uh, to the young children they will actually telecast uh, the ad at the t- at the shows where they are having the pop music or some fun series and the phone and they will show the quality as the good colors or the good or the kids having good time whereas in the second commercial for the business they will show that how efficient the phone is and how good it can handle all the business your introduction was till 40 seconds yeah my introduction was a way more i could ha- i should have me uh, As- like I'll left it at 30 seconds yeah okay anyway you're ready what do you think were done about my response uh, your introduction was far too much which was needed and uh, secondly it was Uh, much complex for a reader to just hear you uh, they are not going to recognize your facial expression so it is a much more difficult task for them because your uh, your introduction didn't take uh, uh, didn't introduce the concept more clearly so i think that if you could have uh, introduced the uh, concept more clearly then it would be much more better and much more comprehensible for any reader who is uh, hearing you and therefore i think uh, first of all limiting the time to introduction is much more than uh, needed to reconstruct your answers uh, it took about 30 to 40 seconds for your introduction and then you try to uh, uh, respond to two different types of commercials and therefore you couldn't conclude well there was not uh, uh, a great conclusion you just ended up with saying that uh, Uh, your business uh, your second part of the example of the business news tv shows it comprised of only two sentences and therefore it didn't give much information though uh, in the uh, uh, in the audio also we didn't get much information but your was uh, too specific and it uh, it seemed that you wanted to conclude within the specific time and therefore you didn't get much time to respond more on these types of uh, specific details therefore i think if time management is done greatly then you could get more time to frame your answers and even if you struck up somewhere you can frame up your answers from that point right i agree with this point for sure that i took more time uh, for the introduction and that's why today in my two or three uh, responses today i have missed the last introduction time because i am taking too long for all my points that's why i'm missing my five, last 5 seconds to give the final conclusion yeah. right so it looks weird that i'm just stopping it upon right. so as soon as i see 58 second or 59 seconds yeah. i am just stopping it there i'm just finishing my line so there is no conclusion line so to all uh, to all the people listening it is very important that you have a conclusion line. so whenever you're ready professor explains the technique of targeting marketing as in um, it's a technique used by advertisers to uh, target um, smaller specific audiences which are more likely to purchase a given company's product he gives a following example to illustrate this point a company that is advertising or uh, that is making a cell phone uh, can uh, employ two different type of commercials um first type one uh, it can be broadcasted uh, during uh, uh, young uh, children's uh, shows and that can f- focus on features of the phone such as like the phone has bright colors um, it is uh, shown that the people using it have a good time 
secondly uh, it can be also be used as a different commercial for the same phone uh, emphasizing the efficiency and how uh, the phone can help the company save money so in two different ways uh, targeting marketing can be used so yeah so actually um, you are four seconds late yes so the last line that you said was an extra yes so you actually completed in like for a minute time. but yes the conclusion line is very much needed so you should have you know arranged it well yes uh, it was nice talking to both of you and yeah, it was it was a nice experience to learn more about how to speak on the token section speaking section and uh, i learned a lot and we always learn from our mistakes and it was a great uh, experience from our mistakes and try to implement the changes which we should have to make ourselves better so it was a great experience right and it was great to listen to your views about i guess about each of our responses yeah. because when you listen to the uh, listeners views you learn right exactly. so correct i guess with this we will end our today's video yes see yeah. you next time see you next time bye bye bye, bye.